Looks like women won't be the only people filing a lawsuit against the University of Tennessee this year. Skeleton Jim here could be next in line. Now Jim is accustomed to being discriminated against, restaurants, hotels, but he was devastated by what happened last Saturday night. He went to one of the concession stands at Neyland Stadium in search of a $20 hot dog and an $8 bottle of water and was denied service. No skeletons, the sign said. Jim intends to sue. I tried to talk him out of it, but have you ever tried talking to a skeleton? They can't even hear. It's like talking to a wall. Greg Isaacs, expect a call.